Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel Canada PR. We hope you are doing great. Results of the provincial nominee program PNP draw were made public last week by British Columbia. Quebec, Prince Edward Island and Saskatchewan. So stay tuned and watch the video till the end. And if you find it useful, please give it a like. In this video, we will discuss the results of the PNP's draw from the previous week. For those who are watching the video for the first time, we kindly ask that you subscribe to our channel and activate the notification bell for more informative videos to come. So without any further delay, let's get into the video. The provincial nominee program draw results were made available this past week in British Columbia, Manitoba and Saskatchewan. Except for Quebec and Nunavut. Each province and territory in Canada runs its PNP. So interested candidate may receive invitations from these programs to apply for a provincial nomination. Provincial nomination can considerably improve a candidate's prospects of getting permanent resident status even though it is not same as a permanent residence. For example, applicants for the PNP with express entry profiles who are nominated will have their CRS score increased by 600 points. They also become qualified to be invited to apply for a round of invites exclusive to the PNP. The rise in PNP admission in Canada is attributable to the fact that both the federal and provincial government see it as a useful tool for improving the nation's economic growth. In response to individuals who have asked when express entry draws are held, well, express entry draws happen once every two weeks. Immigration, refugees and Citizenship Canada have resumed hosting all program express entry lotteries after a long break. Now, we will discuss the PNP draw results from the 19th of August to the 25th of August. For British Columbia, on August 23rd, more than 210 applicants were asked to submit applications for a provincial nomination in British Columbia. Every week, the province of British Columbia conducts a nomination draw, a regionally focused draw with tech-related employment invited 205 individuals in total. Candidates from the categories of international graduates and skilled workers as well as express entry applicants received invitations. For the intended region draw, the minimum acceptable SIRS score ranged from 75 for entry level and semi-skilled candidates 206 for skilled workers with express entry. Similar to the express entry comprehensive ranking system, SIRS only applies to the PNP of British Columbia. Additionally, the province extended invitations to potential employers in the following fields of work. Five healthcare professionals and early childhood educators and assistants with minimum 60 points marks and a scores of at least 60 points for healthcare assistants. Now coming to Saskatchewan, recently Saskatchewan hosted two draws. On August 18th, applicants uh, with minimum score of 67 were called and on August 25th, those with minimum scores of 65 were welcomed. All applicants received invitations under the Saskatchewan Immigration Nominee Program, SINP Express Entry and Forms of Employment Categories. This keeps with Saskatchewan's previous pattern of hosting PNP draws almost every week. The province invited more than 200 candidates to each of the four draws it held in July. Also, note that Saskatchewan only had draws every two months up until July. Now let us talk about Prince Edward Island. On August 18th, 121 potential immigrants were asked to apply under the Prince Edward Island Provincial Nominee Program. Candidates from Express Entry and Labour Impact received a total of 117 invites and the remaining 4 invites were given to applicants for Business Impact who obtained provincial scores of at least 97 points. About once a month, PEI holds draws and publishes its yearly schedule. Finally, if we talk about Quebec, since Quebec has the most control over its immigration policy of any province, it does not take part in the PNP. So those who want to come to Quebec must present a profile to the Arima Provincial Expression of Interest Pool. The candidate whose profiles meets the requirement for an immigration program are then invited by provincial officials. In Quebec, invited candidates must apply for a provincial nomination or a CSQ. On August 9th, 58 applicants were invited to submit applications for a permanent selection under the Quebec Regular Skilled Worker Program by the Ministry of Immigration, Law Franchisation and Integration. 
and candidates needed to have score on their profiles in the ARIMA expression of interest system and a legitimate employment offer from outside the Montreal metropolitan region. So this is it in the video. Thanks for watching the entire video. Uh, visit the link provided in the description to watch the video and learn more about the Express Entry Program and the PNP. Hopefully you enjoyed the episode. Comment below and share your thoughts on this draws. We will also produce a fresh video on this topic. So continue to watch our videos. See you then in the next episode. Till then, take care. Bye-bye.